Hey guys, today we're making a broccoli apple salad with almond butter dressing. This is also a very good meal prep idea if you're trying to not cook. So first you're gonna get some fresh broccoli and you're gonna take off the florets and chop them up into small little pieces and put all of this in a bowl. Then we're gonna shred some carrot and add that to the bowl. And next we're gonna core this apple and chop it up into small little pieces so we don't get huge chunks of apple in our salad because we don't want that. We want a nice little mix of everything. Check out my awesome cutting skills. Oops, messed up. Next, we're going to add our dried fruits, a nice big bunch of dried cranberries. You can add more of this if you'd like, or not add it at all, or just add a little bit. It's to your personal taste. And a nice bunch of raisins. Again, it's to your personal taste. You can add more, or you can just not add it at all. Now we're going to add some walnuts. We're gonna chop them up nicely so we get little pieces through the whole salad. And there it is, we're ready to make our dressing. We're gonna start off with our almond butter. And I was gonna put it in this bowl, but why dirty another dish? Well, you could just do it in here. I have about three tablespoons in there, and that's what you need. So, I'm gonna turn it around because I'm not getting paid. <laughs> Anyway, um, we're gonna start off by adding one tablespoon of olive oil into our almond butter jar. Next, we're gonna add one tablespoon of our ground mustard and a half of an orange and a little bit of water, about four tablespoons I added, I think. It depends on how thick you want it. And then a half a tablespoon of honey. Let's stick on the spoon. And a quarter teaspoon of salt, this is to, to taste. And we're gonna shake it up. And that's it, there's your dressing. Now we're just gonna pour it over this lovely salad that we made. And the thickness of the dressing depends on how much water you add. So if you want a thicker dressing, add less water. If you want a more runny dressing like mine, add the table, the four tablespoons that I added. And there you go. Hope you enjoy watching this video. I hope you try it out. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, thank you very much for watching.